Welcome back guys, you're watching Rivals Femme. This is the FIFA 19 Ultimate Team Series. Today we're going to do the pack openings. So let's have a look, see what we got, shall we? This special promo ones, the ultimate screams, this team of the weeks, walkouts, black cards. Let's take off some good ones today. So we crack on with it? I think we should do. First one off then. Whoa, 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 we got flying start here. Team of the week. Who is it? Attacking midfielder, he's Mexican, he's from LA. It's Carlos Vela, is it, Vela? Um not Bad. It's team of the week. It's probably not one really suits us to be honest. At most, you could probably uh, uh, hope for a good super sub. I mean, it's pace, passing, uh, dribbling, and shooting. We're all in the eighties, so that's quite good. The next one doesn't look very promising, does it? Probably as basic as going to get. Seventy-eight rated striker. Not offering much to be honest for us. Probably one which can discard enough quick selling. And we move on to a defensive midfielder from Turkey. Is it? Is, is it? You call Slu? You call Slu? No idea who he is. Not the greatest start. Probably could have been for a little bit better there. And we've got a placard there. What we got is Brazilian. It's a striker. Hmm. Looking at his face, I think he's more surprised to be a placard than we expect him to be. Um, not the greatest. Pay 64. Shooting 86. Dribbling 84. Could be better. Definitely. Well, could definitely be worse. No placard this time. Gamash. Gamash. Ukrainian, not going to offer anything to our team really, see, a lot of these are probably just going to end up getting rid of at some point, aren't we? What we've got here then, oh no, it's nothing special, is it? It's a goalkeeper, Bayern Munich, it's alright, is it? That's the one. I'd prefer Neuer, but obviously we're not that lucky out to get him. You have to have something special to get him, I think, though. Is he going to be a black? No, it's no black card. It's right midfielder, it's Lens, it's Lens. Yeah, he's playing Premier League, didn't he, at one point? It'd be nice to have if he did, at 90 pace. I mean, everything else is pretty basic, isn't it? Pretty average, I'd say, so. Not offering much more. It's, it's screen team, screen time. What we got? It's an ultimate screen player, he's a right winger. It's Shakiri, isn't it? From Liverpool. That's not bad. Problem is, I did get to record it, but we did get Bernardo Silva, team of the week player. So, Shakiri's probably going to get sold these days, because I don't think he's quite as good as Bernardo Silva. Granted, you know, he's got his. Uh, Oh, we've got two. We've got Mascherano there as well. That's not bad, is it? 1% probability of getting one of them. We get two in a pack. Fantastic. Um, yeah, um, probably so. Oh, another placard. Keeps interrupting. Keeps uh, <laughs> keeps getting it, doesn't it? Villarreal, Marino, come on. How is that worthy of a placard? That's got to be one of the worst placards I think I've ever had. Don't offer much. We've had him before. I think we sold him on. Disappointing. Yeah, so we're going to sell Shakiri. Um, it doesn't really offer much to that. I know we get some temporary raises at certain points of the year based on it being an ultimate scream. Um, but I don't think it's worth it. It's so we've got Bernardo Silva. Uh, so yeah, we'll, we'll get rid of him. What we've got here then? Could it be another placard? It's not. No, it's a centre-back. It, it's a very basic centre-back. Uruguayan, Caceres. Pace, not too bad. Everything else is pretty bang on average. Even if that, to be honest. Next one, hopefully a bit of look. look rub of the green. Right, it's Croatia right back into Milan. Massageco. I mean, he's good. He's very decent. I'm contemplating building an Italian team rather than the Spanish teams. I think you can go further with, with the Spa uh, an Italian team sorry, than you can with the Spanish team. So I think you really need the top players don't you, from Spain to really progress. I think once you hit the 85 mark, there's not much more there that you can get without spending like about a million coins. But in um, Italy, I think you can do. I think they've got, they've got some really good players, between like 85, 87s. And the defence is phenomenal. In fairness, and I like a good defensive team. It's even bloody worse than it this year with defence, though, isn't it? With bloody AI managing it for you. It's hard to break teams down nowadays. Boateng, I wonder if that... It's not Prince Boateng, is it? No, I don't think it is. Not sure, maybe it is. It's changed to be ass. Uh, what are we on to the next one, then? It's... it's oh, it's left-back. And we're just talking of an Italian team, and we've just got our full-backs in if we have. An 81 rated. I thought he had more pace than that, though, to be honest. Obviously, I guess I was wrong. Maybe it's just been downgraded. We've got uh, an ultimate screen one. Is it a promo pack here? Ooh, Bosnian right midfielder. Visca, a little bit of pace. A bit of dribbling. Visca is not the greatest for a wing. He's probably never get used, to be honest, this year. On to another promo pack here. What we got then? Oh, God. Proper turd burglar again. Goalkeeper. Um, not offering much at all, is it? Jarstein? I don't know. On to the next one. It's got to be a pro. Oh, we've got something glittery here. What's it going to be? Well, that's a bit of an anticlimax, isn't it? Something that's glittery. Uh, I mean, it's all right. It'll, it'll fill a slot, won't it? Particularly after that Italian team. Because it plays for where, Torino. It's another glittery one. Does glittery mean crap or something? Because this is definitely not anything special, is it? 
Are these like ones that are verging on good, which I'll never use? Is that what the glittery ones mean? Another, it's going to be bang average, but yeah. Told you. Butch geese. Guides. We sold him. We don't need him at all. We sold him because we replaced him. So that's a waste of money, isn't it? We had Lamar, then we got rid of him and switched the team up a little bit since then. Ooh, right back. Ooh, from Spain. He's not going to get in ahead of Samido, is he? Don't beat him on any of stance, I don't think. Samido's our current one. I'm not just saying it for a laugh. Um, on to the next one. No, Spanish. Goalkeeper. Casillas. Not too bad. It's never going to get in, to be honest. I can't see where we're going to fit in him. We're never going to have a Portuguese team, so it seems a bit of a waste. I don't think it's going to be worth much on transfer market either. No placard again still. There was a left midfield at Argentinian. <laughs> Christ, he looks like the uh, baby Tevez, doesn't he? The Kuna. <laughs> don't look as good as Tevez, though, does he? On to the next one, then. What we got here, guys and girls? It's no placard. It's going to be decent rated, though. It's a striker. It's Belletti, isn't it? Belotti? It's not, I suppose he's all right. It's really not going to help us out, unless we build that Spanish team. Sorry, Italian team. But it's probably going to help out there. Placard, what we got? Is it a walkout? It's Ozil. That's not bad. We've got an English Premier team. He'll probably slot in very well. Passing 86, so he should have good vision, I imagine. Dribbling 86. He pace a little bit of a letdown, but if you're playing him through the centre, maybe you can play pacey players off him. So, yeah, that's not too bad, not too shabby. I don't think it's going for much in the market. Another placard here, then, guys. What we got is Portuguese defensive midfielders. And I'm fine, much on this one, isn't it? William Cavalio. We have got Casemiro, so he's nowhere near at his level, is he? And then the only way we're going to use him is if we use, like, um, you know, a two defensive midfielders, which we're probably not going to. Um, nothing much from me. Another screen promo pack. Oh, actually, it's not not bad. It was Roman Sonsi. I liked him on last game, actually, as well. He got a special card, which was fantastic. It was hard to beat, hard to beat one in the last game. Um, it was the Italian team. Another placard. Spanish. Striker. Ooh, Rodri. We've got him. We've got him. So he's definitely going to get sold on. What a waste. He's gone. He's gone. Good player, though. I do quite like him. He was a bit more on ball rather than just pace. Another promo pack here. Centre back from Brazil, Benfica. Is it? Yeah. Jardel. Mm. Not offering much. He's a slow centre back as well, 57 pace. On to another team of the week. Yeah, it's not team of the week. Screen, screen team pack, promo pack. Oh, Podence. Podence. Yeah, he, he can run and dribble a bit, but that's all he's got. It's physical 49. Christ, he'd get bullied off ball all the time, wouldn't he, if you used him? It's a, it's a placard. Is it a walkout? Left back, is it Al it's Alba, guys! Jordi Alba! Fantastic! Absolute fantastic player. Um, I mean, look, it's, it's brilliant all around in it. Defence is uh, 72, it's great for a full back. 83 dribbling, 79 pa passing, which is good. 69 shooting, we don't care. Um, 79 defence, and we're at 90 odd uh, pace. So, yeah, brilliant all around player to have in team. Absolute delight with that one. I've got another placard. Who can. Oh, right, now that's. We've got this guy as well. I think most people have. I think the only upgrade we're going to get now in, in the Spanish league is a massive upgrade. It's going to be El Black, isn't it, from Atletico Madrid? I think it's going to be a difficult one to get, though, isn't it? Very difficult. On to the next one, then, guys. I think there's only a few more packs left to go. Who we got? It's a, it's a promo pack again. Is it a plat? No, no. The, the trend of the placards does not continue. We don't get a hat trick of them. It's Visca. It's the Bosnian. Nothing much to write home about, though. So quickly end that one and uh, run on to the next one. Um. Oh, Serbian defensive midfield. Oh, it's um, yeah from Benfica. I mean, he's good. I mean, defense eighty-two, physical eighty-three. It's not bad. We're never going to use him, are we? At all. On to the last one. Then I believe this one is another Premier pack opening. Who we got? Oh, it's the right back from uh, Napoli. Mm, not too bad. Decent player. It's not too bad, guys. I mean, all in all, it's a good set of draws. Yeah, we've got Orsil, we've got Bernardo Silva, which unfortunately I didn't, um, I didn't get the highlights for. Silly me. I thought recording obviously wasn't. Um, but yeah, I mean, the Shakiri one should bring in quite a bit of coin. Mascherano one, probably not so much so, but yeah, definitely worth it. Um, so there's a few interesting ones in there then, guys. I mean, by all, all means, drop in comments. Who did you get? Hopefully you got someone a bit more better and excited than me, you know, because we've got some good ones, but I'm guessing there's some people there who got some absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal draws. We are a doubt. I mean, to get over over 87 rated ones, I think it's like 4.5%. It's minimal, very minimal. Uh, but we've got one of them, don't we? We've got an 87 rated Halper. That's fantastic. I'm very happy with him. Fits into our team as well. So... Gonna leave it there then guys. So hopefully you enjoyed that one. If you did, smash that like button, show me some support. 
comments and questions in the comment section. Even if you want to say hi, fantastic. I'll get right back to you on that one as well. Advice recommendations, stick that in the comment section as well. I'll be very, uh, very keen to hear if anyone has any sort of advice recommendations that they can throw my way. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. If you're new to the channel, subscribe because there's regular daily content coming out, particularly around FIFA. And hopefully I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys.